Yeah, good evening, Christopher. So Bonnie Linden's pantry had been up since July of last year. We did the story when it went up, and she's not letting it go away without a fight. And now the mayor and city council are involved. This sign stands where a community cupboard used to be outside of Bonnie Linden's Capitola home. It had been up since July and hundreds of people would use it. So hundreds of pounds of food would pass through this cupboard each month. It was a place where neighbors could come and share food with other neighbors in need. Similar free pantries have popped up around Santa Cruz County over the past year or so. But complaints from some of Linden's neighbors prompted city staff to ask her to take it down. I mean, it breaks my heart, really. It had become part of my life. They're worried that there are some people who uh, might be coming around at night to collect food that might also be accounting for some of the break-ins they've been experiencing on that street. I don't think that's the case. The mayor of Capitola says he feels strongly about the need to help people who are hungry in his city, but they'd like to potentially craft an ordinance to allow free pantries to exist in the city because he says technically right now they aren't allowed. And we want to put it in a place that's convenient and is um, in keeping with the zoning ordinances of Capitola. Or we need to create zoning ordinances that deal with them. But Lyndon says the longer her community cupboard sits empty and unused, the more people go without food. They are restricting our freedom to engage with each other socially, to assemble and to share food and to help each other. Now we're told that another part of the ordinance will address exactly what kind of food goes into these free pantries. Um, there was a concern that there was um, uh, prepared food going into the pantries and they sort of want um, non-prepared food or canned food and non-perishable items to go into the pantries. Christopher. All right. Okay. Thank you, Sierra. The mayor, uh, mayor plans to bring the ordinance on free pantries before the city council on April 26th.